Welcome to Midnight Mule FPL. I'm Midnight Mule and this is the video for Game Week 29 where a lot of managers are free hitting and I'm free hitting. I'm going to show you my team which is pretty similar to all the other teams you've already seen this week. But before that, let's see who did well in Game Week 28. Top scorer in our league for Game Week 28 was James Stevens, and he's the 2024 FPL winner. Isn't that nice? 95 points. He managed that with Sun 17, Captain Solanke 16, Semenyo 15, Palmer 13, Garnacho 9, Sabania 8, Dello 6, and Doughty 5. So pretty good there. And no points on the bench, which is always nice to see. Top of our league is still Mohamed Sabith K with Arteta Kurz. He got 55 points for this game week. That was with Captain Solanke 16, Palmer 13, Zabania 8, Doughty 5. And I think that's all with, again, nothing on the bench. As for me, I'm down in 198th place. I got 70 points. That was with Sun 17, Captain Slanky 16, Palmer 13, Doughty 5, Estupinan 6. Aren't you glad I kept him? Neto 4. Well, I'm glad I kept him anyway. This might be the last week I ever play him, though, at least this season. Then on my bench, I had Garnacho for 9. But there's none of my 7 outfield players that I would have put on the bench instead of Garnacho, so that's okay. So two green arrows in a row, that's nice. And I'm 12 points to the wrong side of half a million rank, and I'm 293 from top spot. And with 10 weeks left, that means if I can get 30 points more than whoever's top for the next 10 weeks, I can win the whole thing. So that's nice. Thank you very much to everyone who watches this and subscribes and likes and comments and all that sort of thing. But I think watching's the main thing. So on the FPL Game Week website, you can see the Content Creators League and FPL Fran. Not only is he top, but he's now got the same score as the top player in the Midnight Mule Mini League. So I can only guess that he watches these videos and gets some good ideas. And we've got Ben Crellin down in third. Mark Southerns is seventh. And good old Harry's made it back onto our screen. He's up into eighth now. As for me, I'm all the way down into 67th and I'm still behind as... But this week, as took a hit to take a stupid man out and then get in someone who wasn't worth getting in. So that helped me a little bit. Let's hope he um, does something fun for the free hit this week. Transfers for game week 29. I'm free hitting. So there's a lot of transfers. Uh, this is pretty similar to other teams you're going to see out there, but not exactly the same. Sun gets to wear the old mule hat with his mates Poro and Madsen also playing their away to Fulham. I've got Bowen at home to Villa as vice-captain with his mate Kudos. I've got Doughty at home to Forrest. And then I've got Tony and his mate Regulon away to Burnley. And I've got Watkins away to West Ham. Regulon and Watkins may not play. A bit of doubt around them. But that's okay because I've got a bench and they'll hopefully all be all right. Now the obvious best striker to get next is Morris. But I really want to get Fafana. And I probably won't get him any other point in the season. So that's who I'm choosing this week. As for the clean sheets and the keeper, it's luck. <laughs> Who's going to get a clean sheet this week? Nobody knows. So I'm going for the Forest keeper. Away to Luton. I think he's got as good a chance as anyone. And it mixes things up nicely. So I've got two or three players from every game this weekend playing. And then on my bench, i got Trafford. If he gets all his homework done, then hopefully he'll be available to play. I've got Paqueta, home to Aston Villa. I'd be very happy to play Paqueta. So if... Watkins doesn't play at all. That suits me fine. And then Robinson at home to Tottenham. And then Toffolo away to Luton. So there's a remote chance. If two of my defenders don't play, I'll be doubling up with my Forest at the back. As for the background picture, you may have seen in the news this week that Elon Musk's SpaceX managed to get Starship up into space just about this week. So we don't know what future that's going to hold, but I suspect it's got something to do with cats in space with a football. And there we have it, my free hit team for game week 29. There could be some crazy scores this week, as in crazy low scores this week. So there's lots of fun to be had. And it's the FA Cup. So after this weekend, we'll have a good idea which teams are doubling, which teams are blanking in probably game week 34 and possibly game week 37. Let's hope for a lot of fun this weekend. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>